Listen, I'm really sorry about your hand. Oh, don't worry about it. I must have cut it when I swooned. I startled you. <laughs> I didn't know there was anyone else down here. I thought it was just the three of us. <laughs> well, I often work nights, so perhaps that's why you haven't seen me. Gosh, it's very cold in here, isn't it? Mmm, air conditioning. Keeps these things cool? Yes, what are they? I have no idea. <laughs> they put me in charge of them. Moss and Roy. I don't know their names. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I don't know what any of this stuff even does. <laughs> What's going on there? <laughs> I don't know. Is it good that it's doing that? <laughs> Occasionally it doesn't do that, and I think I should tell them, but often I just look away. <laughs> and this one. Flash, 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 and wait for it. Nothing for a while. Here it comes. Double flash. <laughs> Brilliant. Wow. It's obvious you're going mad. <laughs> so, let me get this straight. You stay down here all the time. <laughs> I pop out occasionally when I have to get supplies. <laughs> and you don't know why you're here or what you do. Correct. So this is your job? This is, this is what you want for a career? No. You don't understand. I'm not here because I want to be here. This is... This is my punishment. You see, I used to be Denham's second in command. Do I amaze you? So, how did you end up down here? <laughs> That's a question I've been asking myself for four long years. Oh, I couldn't help noticing that you're Bleeding. Yes, no, it's fine. It's just, just a little neck. No, it's fine. I can't Please, deal I can with myself at help. home. I no, can... no, it's got on to the... Oh, my... Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Please, excuse me! Excuse me! What do you do? Oh, 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 get off me! Get off! Oh. <laughs> Thank you. That should clear up nicely. <laughs> yes, there was a time when things were very different. I was one of Renham Industries' top guys. You should have seen me. I was magical. Here's me saying some pretty important stuff to a group of people circled around me. <laughs> In the boardroom, I was a wizard, a punchy character. Here's me with a graph. <laughs> Things were moving fast, so fast. My career was advancing by leaps and bounds. Denham saw great things for me. They were crazy, heady days. <laughs> It seemed like those days would last forever, but it all changed. Wow. So, what happened? Well, it's quite a long story, actually. Really? Don't worry about it, then. My good gracious me, look at that! Whoa! Quick! What is it? I can't explain it. You're just going to have to come over here and look out this window for a while. Look, whatever it is, we're not interested. Well, I have to say, you're missing out. Fine. Jiminy Jones! Look, the nature of the thing that is happening has changed slightly, <laughs> rendering it yet more interesting. Someday I'll tell my kids about this. Well, you can't even tell us. How are you going to tell your children? Well, you have no interest in the world. Are you sure it's OK to come out? Yeah, don't you worry about those two. Now, listen, Richmond, I've always wanted to know, yeah? Why do you never see any Cockney Goths? They're too cheerful. <laughs> you spoil it for the rest of us. And, and how come you never see Goths driving cars? Oh, yeah, we drive cars. We're just like you, really, except that we listen to Cradle of Filth. <laughs> Cradle of 
filth? I presume that's a band. Mm. It's not literally a cradle of filth. Oh, no, that would be horrible. <laughs> cradle of filth are actually one of the best contemporary dark wave bands in the world. I never forget the first time I heard them. <laughs> Changed my life. Blew my mind. It was lucky I discovered them when I did, because it was around that time that things started to go wrong for me at work. I don't know what happened, but suddenly people just weren't returning my calls. <laughs> In my strategy meetings, people seemed distracted, distant. I couldn't put my finger on it, but something was wrong. I'll tell you, it was good to have the filth to come home to after another disappointing day. You've got to help Roy! Richmond's out of his room. He's not in his room. He's supposed to be in his room. Why is he out of his room? Well, <laughs> he's going to come out and play with us for a while. But the rainforest and... What's wrong with you, Moss? Roy's stuck underneath a lady's desk. What still? Look, I know that normally this would be very funny, but he's been under there too long for a reasonable explanation. If that woman looks down, she's going to assume he's a desk rabbit. What's a desk rabbit? I just made that up. <laughs> But that's probably going to be what they start to call people like Roy. But Roy's not a desk rabbit. He's my best friend. Unless you do something, it's just going to be you, me and Tim Burton over there. <laughs> what can I possibly do? I... Look, she could look under there any minute. It could already be too late. But I don't know what to do. Your what... relationship manager. This falls under relationships. All right, all right. Just to shut you up. Hello, Richmond. How are things? Oh, you know, <laughs> not brilliant. <laughs> it's supposed to be in his room. 